you like to impress your friends with weird things? Watch our new decor and craft ideas selection. Let's make a felt necklace in cool shades first. Take a piece of felt and cut out half inch strips of various length. Make several of the same details of other colors. Hot glue the ends of a felt strip to shape a loop. Continue sticking the rest of the details in the same way. Let's attach all the felt details to form a necklace. Hot glue the loops one by one, alternating size and color. Align the elements to look neat. Fasten extra big loops in the middle for the necklace to keep shape. Attach a chain to the back side. Cover the attachment place with a strip of dark felt. Cut off the excess. Add hot glue to the chain to attach the felt strip. Cut off the excess. Put two jump rings on the end chain links. Attach a lobster clasp. The stylish bib necklace will perfectly complete your outfit. In this video, we'll show how to make multi-level leather cord earrings with metal charms. We'll need blue leather cord, metal charms, round nose pliers, two French hooks, two jump rings, and two tube connectors. Hot glue the cord end. Pass it through the tube connector and press over to attach well. Thread a charm and pull up nearly to the end. Pass the second end through the other side of the connector. Pull up to shape a ring. Thread another charm and pull up. Pass the cord through the tube to make another ring bigger than the previous one. Continue in the same way. Keep in mind that the level should increase. Hot glue the cord end. Put it into the tube connector and press over. You only need to set the French hook. Open a jump ring and pass it through the loop on the connector. Put on the hook. Close the ring. Cool! Make another earring by following the same steps. The cute, fashionable leather cord earrings will emphasize your personality and add glamour to your image. Now, let's make a cool paperclip jewelry set. Start with a necklace. Wind red tape around a clip. Make five to six neat winds and snip off the excess. Fasten an uncovered clip to the red one. Join these two with another clip to form a triangle. Wind yellow tape around the uncovered edges. Add more clips to make new triangles. Continue wrapping the clips. Alternate the colors. We'll need eight elements for the first row. The second row consists of five triangles. You'll need to add two details in this row as the first row clip forming one edge of the triangle. The necklace is shaped as a big triangle consisting of multiple small ones. 
Put the two vertices on the chain links. Fasten a lobster clasp. The bright, colorful geometric necklace will enrich your jewelry collections. Make the same styled earrings. Bend two clips to form triangles. Hot glue orange embroidery floss to the edge. Wind the thread around the clip. Add the glue as far as needed. Attach the red thread. Wrap the triangle at random. Repeat for the orange thread on top. Fasten the ends and cut off the excess. Make another earring in the same way. Pass a ring through the thread and put on the clip wrapped around with the yellow tape. Hang the red clip on the second earring. Put on the French hooks as a finishing touch. The fabulous earrings will match the geometric necklace. In today's tutorial, we'll show you how to make an unusual ring from beads. We'll need decorative pins, a metal ring base, glass beads, round pliers, flat pliers, and cutting pliers. Take a decorative pin and thread a bead. Cut off the excess using the cutting pliers. Make a loop using the round nose pliers. Work up a big heart-shaped bead of a deep wine shade in the same way. Proceed in the same way with the rest of the beads. Take a ring and open it carefully using tools. Put it in the center of the ring base. Attach the heart and close the ring. Secure the other beads in the same way. Keep in mind the beads should be placed so that the decoration looks like a large compact bunch. Alternate the beads of different sizes. We've made a stylish, bright piece of bead jewelry. This heart ring will make your image romantic. Now try another idea. What about a space bottle necklace? Okay, let's do it. Tear off a small cotton piece and put it in the vial. Add blue paint mixed with the water. Use the brush. The paint flows down the glass, coloring the cotton on the bottom. Pour in some glitter. Add glycerin. Put in another piece of cotton. Add some paint. The flowing paint creates a unique pattern. Add some more raw cotton. The glitter and cotton fibers together make it an awesome combination. Add some red paint. Another cotton portion, some glycerin, and the glitter. Expand the color palette by adding a red and yellow mixture. Add another cotton layer. We're getting a unique color mixture. Continue changing the shades, layering with the cotton and glitter. Keep in mind the glycerin. Cork the vial. The space bottle necklace looks the most magical of all the others. The glycerin prevents mixing the color layers. Let's paint the jar in an original way. We'll melt wax, so we broke the wax crayons into pieces, lit a candle, and took a tablespoon. Put a yellow piece in the spoon and heat. Carefully pour the wax into a ball-shaped jar. Tilt it and twist it to let the wax flow over the inside. Melt another color, green. Add it on top of the yellow. Tilt the jar again to let the green wax flow over the yellow colors and the glass. Add the red wax on top. Spread it out. Now the lemon hue, blue, and apricot. Hold the jar upside down to let the wax paint all over the inside. This eye-catching bottle necklace differs greatly from all the others. We used pure, bold colors, no shades, no mixing. There are clearly visible borders between the color layers. Subscribe to Troom Troom. Hit the like and bell buttons. As soon as the bell rings, watch the new uploaded video.